Well, after weeks of pleas from Insurance Commissioner Jim Donilon to do something about the insurance crisis, Governor Edwards gives the green light to a special session. Lawmakers will consider dedicating $45 million to attract insurance companies to come do business in the state. WGN's Kenny Lopez is here with more on how that's going to work. Kenny. That's right, Kurt and Susie. The biggest issues right now are there aren't enough insurance companies in the state and policyholders are faced with paying higher rates for their storm coverage. We're in a crisis. That's clear. This $45 million that's being proposed to go into an incentive fund that was created last year, to me, if successful, would just be one of many steps that need to take place. Step by step, State Senator Royce DuPlessis wants to work through the insurance problems in Louisiana with other lawmakers and insurance commissioner Jim Donilon during the special session. But there's no question that we have to take some type of action. Yet for him, there are still many questions in regards to the $45 million incentive fund, which would lure insurance companies to our state. But is it incentivizing the right insurance companies? We want good insurance companies that can come here and do business that can deliver in the time of need. After Hurricane Katrina, there was a similar incentive program, which is now raising more questions. We have to make sure that the companies who are actually coming here to do business are not fly-by-night companies. That's something led us to this point. So how are we going to prevent the same mistakes from happening? Now, I feel the pain. I, actually, my insurance company that I've been using for years quit covering in Louisiana. So I lost my coverage. I had to bind new coverage last week myself. And I, I know the pain because my premium more than doubled. Financial professional and wealth advisor Gregory Ricks understands the insurance crisis, but says no matter what, you can't drop your insurance. That would leave you uncovered. You, you've taken the risk off of the insurance company and put it on yourself. This is one of the reasons you want to build an emergency fund. So one way to offset higher premiums is to be able to have higher deductibles. And ultimately, lawmakers say they want the special session to benefit homeowners. We have to work to try to find the solutions to reduce premiums, to reduce the costs that are being passed on to, to citizens. Now, the special session is set to begin January 30th and go through February 5th. Curtin Susie, much more to come on this issue. Hopefully, more competition will lead to lower rates. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Kenny. And still ahead on WGNO News, the head of the state Democratic Party hints at a run for governor. And another severe weather threat moving in tomorrow night. Details on that coming up.